Hello everyone, Tila from Perfect Pronunciation Academy. Today I'll be continuing on the topic of stress and intonation in speaking. So English has got very different stress and intonation on speaking and today I'll be talking, oh my screen disappeared, um, on sentence stress. So what you have to do, a simple thing is to select a word in a sentence that you like to emphasize on and then put stress on it. So we talked about increasing pitch, increasing volume, um, lengthening the vowel, many different ways to put the stress on it. So I will just speak a sentence um, and then I'll tell you the words that I stressed on. No child wants a book that is old. So three words that I stressed on is once a book that is old. So I kind of increased my volume. Um, because I want to emphasize that no child wants a book that is old, right? Um, and the other one I'm going to emphasize is the same sentence. Have a listen. No child wants a book that is that old. Okay, emphasizing on that old. Um, so, you know, you have to listen to how people speak in English, to listen to their rhythm and to follow the rhythm because rhythm is quite an innate thing. It's like the tonality and the musicality of language. It's almost like you have to sing along with it or you have to kind of go along with the ride and that's how you can get on the other train which is moving at a different rhythm to your train, right? So. Um, how, do you, how do you do that? That's probably the million dollar question, hey. And how do you do that is by reading English poetry because that is short and that has got a good rhythm and that's how you <clears throat> improve on your rhythm. So remember this, English is a stress timed language and so the stresses occur at appropriate intervals. So they're always there. If you don't know how on earth to stress in English, um, just listen to lots of traditional nursery rhymes or poetry. Poetry because they will tell you where to emphasize. And just Google some and you have lots of different poetry and you'll be able to um, yeah, get your rhythm in no time. If I can help you with that, please ping me on perfectpronunciationacademy.com and I'll be more than happy to help you there. See you later.